Hey, what's going on everyone? This is Ari Views back with another video and today we're taking a look at AI apps. I have eight AI apps to share with you guys, which are great apps and most of them are actually also very, very useful. Now, of course, AI is the future and you can find AI pretty much everywhere, websites, different tools and now of course apps as well. So here in this video, we have eight amazing apps that I believe every iPhone user must try on their device. The first app for the video is called the Riz. This one is really interesting. You can use it within the app or you can also use the Riz keyboard, which basically does the same function as the app, but you can use it, of course, outside of the app in any other app you want. So basically with Riz, you can create anything you want, like maybe a post, a tweet or something like that. It's most used for like social media posts. So, or basically you just go here and just tap anything you want. Let's say I want to just compose a tweet here. Let's compose something just like that. Just like add anything you want and it will actually create something for you. So let's just wait here. And here it says, I'm having an amazing dinner. The food is delicious and the company is great. So it will just create anything for you, any tweet, any post you want, maybe for your social media, you can just go ahead and create it. Just give it an idea of what you want to do and it will do it for you. As I said, you can use it also within other apps. So if I just have here something like tweet about summers here on Twitter, all I have to do is select it. Now go to the keyboard and say here, give me a Riz. It will do that for you. Just like that, you can see it will actually create the Riz and will replace the text you selected with the text that it will actually create, which is really, really cool. Now, here's another really useful one. This one will create any playlist you want. It works with Apple Music and Spotify as well, and you can create a playlist very easily. So you tap on create a playlist and what you can do here is add maybe images, videos, rewind or just use a prompt add any word you want and it will create like a playlist based on what you add there so i can just go ahead and type anything there just describe the playlist you want maybe anything you want like basketball songs i've written there basketball songs now it will show me right here a few different artists that it has found and of course i can go ahead and deselect any of them if i want to and then what I can do here is go ahead and tap on next. And it will create the playlist for me. So right here we can edit the cover and all that. You can choose how many songs per artist you want to have. Let's say we want two for each artist. We can do it just like that. Tap on done and we're good to go. Now we have a playlist created just simply by describing to the app what we want to see. We can open now this playlist on Spotify or we can just tap done. It will save the playlist. We can copy it, share it anytime we want directly from the app. Next up is Walter AI. Now this is an amazing app which gives you answer for anything you need. Now you might think that it will just give you results from the web search, but it actually is way better than that. It will give you detailed answers for anything you ask and you will see on the results. It's really, really great. So let's just try it out and ask the app who has scored the most points in NBA history and let's see the result. So the question is ready, tap on search and now you will get the answer and you will see right here, it has a lot of details on the answer. It's a complete answer with everything you need to know. So right here you can see, it says in this case, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, highest scoring points, 38,000 followed by LeBron James and you can see every other detail here, all the other players, it will actually give you a proper answer for everything you want. Watson AI is the next app for the video. Now this is basically a chat where you can just talk about anything you want and you will get replies from the app. It's very simple to use, you open the app, tap right there, talk to Watson and here you can type anything you want, ask questions or just talk about any topic you want. So here you will have some like pre-made here, so just tap on motivate in this case and ask that question and you will of course get the reply from the app you can go on and talk with the app here it will give you replies just like a real human so here is just asking us what has caused to make you feel unmotivated let's just say i'm tired so tap right there the button and again we will get actually a proper answer which is really really cool sketch ai is the next app for the video now this app will create digital art based on sketches that you make 
So when you go into the app, you will see here some pre-made. So you can see this one right here, how cool that is. So you can go ahead and choose a black canvas or import a photo or take a photo and then create the art based on those photos. Or you can just choose a blank canvas right here and just paint maybe anything you want. So let's just try here a star maybe. Tap right there now and you can describe what you have like sketched right here so let's just say 3d star so once you have added the description you have here also styles you can choose some presets one but of course you can also go ahead and choose here from different categories like maybe things or photograph artists and all that so let's just try this one and tap on generate now it will generate that art based on our sketch and of course all the descriptions that we have made there and you can see how cool that looks now, of course on the description there you can add more things like in case in my case i just said 3d star i could set red 3d star or something like that and it will actually match the description that you add there the next one is also an art ai app it's called wonder and it will basically create any art you want so you can just describe anything you can think of and it will create it it will actually create it for you so let's just add a prompt here let's say something like let's say ferrari on the moon so let's just try that out so we have added there the, basically the description and we have different styles we can choose here so we can pick any style we want actually and then once you have done that you tap on generate now if you're using the free version which i'm using in my case you will have to watch a couple of ads before generating the image and of course if you have the pro version you don't have to do that so let's just watch the ads and we will come back with the result and there we have the result you can see how actually cool this is now what you can do here is of course download the photo to your photo library you can have the original right there or the framed one and you can also choose high resolution if you're actually using the pro version but you can see how cool that looks it's really really awesome and as i said you can think of anything and create art out of that next up is wisdom ai this is an amazing app as well i've tried it it actually works really good you can use this maybe to write essays or something like that and it works really really well so let's just ask the app to write us an essay so here we're asking the app to write us an essay on new york just a random topic tap on send and in a few seconds here you will see the results it will actually just write a proper essay so right here you can see everything here it shows all the different like essays or the art anything you can ask the app everything will be shown here like you can ask the app maybe to write a poem maybe to draw something maybe to write an essay anything you want you will have it right on the app here you can see how simple the app is all you have here is just home screen just type the end the question and you will get a proper answer and last but not least is ai art maker this is also an art app that lets you create any art you can think of you can add your own settings even your own photos and create any art you want so you tap the plus button right here and there you will have the description so on the description you can just imagine anything you want and type it there so once you have added the description you can go ahead and choose here maybe like the drawing type let's just choose 3d in this case you can choose colors details all that you can also add the input from your own images or just pick these images that are right here once you have done all this you have added everything you need tap on generate and wait for the art to be generated and you can see how good it will match with what you have typed there you can see how cool this looks of course you can add show the prompt here of what you have typed you can save it you can make it into a card or you can edit if you want to which is really really cool so that is it for this video guys i hope you guys enjoyed the video and the apps that you saw on this video if you want to download any of these apps you can go ahead and check out the pinned comment you will find all the links there again thank you guys for watching the video don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this and i will see you on the next one